Hello, what's up, YouTube? Here, Ark and Anan brings another battle. This battle is going to be against Tarek, known as uh, Derpy Derp on Discord channel. Uh, the team that I'm using right now is the same team that I used in, in the last video. Uh, and well, on his on his side, he has a Martian, Espion, Flygon, he has the Flareon, Umbreon, and last but not least, it has the double A. A very, a very, a very good team, a very offensive. The only tall type Pokemon that I can see it comes to be uh, Umbreon. But let's start with the match. I'll start with my Slowbro, and he will go with Marsham, which I actually can resist his attack. He goes for knockoff, which is super effective and gets to take away my key berry. And I go for the Skull Beat. And well, I'm not sure his Pokemon is actually a Gnogar or, uh, or the, the other one, a Grass ability. But well, most of the time they use Nogar, and I use Slack off because I know since I don't have the object anymore, the damage that is gonna cause the knockoff is not is not much. Like before, he makes a switch, go for do goes for double blade, receive receive the attack of Scold. Now he's gonna go for the Sword Dance, raising his attack plus two, and I go I'm not gonna go for the skull one more time. Um, the damage that I cause is like uh, 30% or 33%, but this time I get to burn this Pokemon, this Dog Blade, and well, I think uh, the burn, he uh, cut the, uh, the attack into half, I'm not sure. He goes for the Shadow Sneak, the damage that he caused to my Pokemon is not that good. And I go for the Slack Off, Trying to gain all my HP back, and well, he's gonna use Shadow Sneak one more time. And well, even though being super effective, it's not enough. Then I go for the skull, and I get to kill his Pokemon. Now he's gonna send Espion, which, if he has Shadow Ball, I think I can survive the attack. And well, he actually goes for the Shadow Ball, which is super effective against Mass Lobro. And guess the kid, maybe his, maybe his Pokemon is a choice pet, I'm not sure. So I send my Snorlax and he makes a switch using Machamp, which I go, I went for curse, I mean, raising my attack and defense. I know I can resist one attack of his Machamp. And well, he goes for Dynamic Punch. That actually confirms that he actually is a no garb. And well, my Snorlax is not going to attack, he's gonna, I mean, he actually is gonna attack, but he's gonna hit himself. And well, in the next dynamic punch, he gets to kill my Snorlax, which is going to be super effective. Now I send my Bruce Lee with the Reckless, Reckless ability, and since since he doesn't have uh, his uh, double light, that's why I go for the attack of High Jump Kick. Now he's gonna send Flareon. I'm not sure if I can defeat his Pokemon. So I call my Human Chan, uh, him only, I mean, to send my Charizard because Flare Blitz is not super effective. Even though it's not super effective, the damage is really, really good. I survive with 41 HP. I go for the Air Slash, predicting it switch because otherwise, uh, I wouldn't go for the uh, ancient power, but uh, a next flare blitz gets to kill my Charizard. Well, he is almost like almost dead. He's Flareon. I send my Blastoise. I'm gonna Mega Evolve, evolve my uh, my Pokemon, my Blastoise, and well, in case he tried to make make a switch, I go for the. Uh, our sphere, which is neutral damage against his Pokemon, and now he sent Espion. And I have the, I, I, I have the, um, our, I mean the Dark Pulse, just in case, because it's super effective. And I get to kill his Pokemon. Psychic actually, he did a really good damage against my Pokemon, and he now he's gonna send Rygon, and he goes for the Outrage, and in that range. My Blastoise, well, it won't survive. It won't be able to actually to handle one attack of his Flygon. Now he goes for Outrage one more time. Uh, I was able to. I was almost. I almost used the power, but I was like, what a 
what if I miss sleep powder or what if he wakes up in the, in the first one so that's why I went for the giga, giga drain and now he goes to the average and gets to kill my Venusaur but he he'll actually use uh, the average three times and I'm not sure if I'm able to kill him so I go for the Mac punch and he survives with almost nothing and because he's confused because of the average he hits himself and the last Pokemon that he has is Umbreon which I have the extra bell and I go for the high jump king high jump kick well he actually had the protect but maybe I don't know but he told me actually he maybe he was deciding to go in to protect or maybe he just forgot about it but that's going to be the battle against Tarek I hope you like the battle uh, we're here Arcana 9 see you next time and bye